Ah, there we go. Yeah, that looks good. All right, so we're going to put the arterial in first. And I want you to just turn your arm aside. The needle is, there's that little hole right there. And I know the angle. And sometimes it just, there it went, right? Just slid right in. And you can see the flash there, the blood coming up a little bit. Now you can see why I put the gauze on there so that it's not uh, putting tape on her sight. Next we put what's called the chevron on here to keep this needle sliding out. from sliding out. Fold the tape over a little bit so that it's easy to get off. And tape once more. So that's that's the arterial. Now we're going to do the venous. The venous is very slight. You can see the hole there. And I just barely get it underneath the skin. And just gently move it in. And it, there's already you see the flash and I'm going to put the tape right there and get the chevron like this like so like so and tape the chevron down with another piece of tape over the top and there you go, now we've made our connections. Cannulation. And I bleed the lines. Sometimes lay it on there, twist it a little bit, make sure it's airtight. You don't want any air leaks because that's where the blood is sucking from. It's sucking it from Sheila. Okay, I didn't have to untangle anything too much there. Always double check to see it's clamped. Because if it's not clamped you're gonna have a spray of blood. A spray of blood and I did that once and once was all I want. That's enough. Okay. Alright, I'll give that to you. So their greens are open. Connections are made. The red and blue are open. I'm going to turn the cycler on. I always hit it three times. And the greens are open there, greens are open there, the yellows are connected and open, and the whites, the whites are closed so that no fluid from here flows back into her. And so we're now we're gonna hit the kidney button. And now, one last important thing is this is the 10 cc syringes that goes on to lines coming out of our bag. The red one we're going to use to flush her 
venous or her arterial line at the end of the treatment. And that's why I'm gonna unlock it and bring 10 cc's in there so that it's ready to go. All right. Thank you, Mark.